Constantine suddenly doesn't look pasty anymore. Hi guys, it is time for Ismail's season of truck. I'm so excited. I am so freaking excited. This is the first, I believe, I believe non-binary scam season, which is insane and so exciting and honestly like awesome. And I have faith that Druck will do it right. Um, Ismail grew on me so much last season. And I'm just like really excited to get to know them and get to see what's going on in their head. Because they have a lot to say when speaking to Fatu. And I feel like they're deeper than we think at this point. Um, yeah, and then their love interest I'm sure they're going to have. I saw like a screenshot from a scene when this was airing. And it seemed like they had a male love interest. I don't know if that was love interest. I think it was a love interest. But and nonetheless, I'm so excited to get started on this episode and to get started on the season. Um, I'm going to be trying to post these like every week so that I can like for real just get caught up, you know. And then season, is it season eight? Is it going to be season eight after this? Is uh, currently airing. And that's Malin season, right? Malin that's gonna be exciting too um Druk is just like is killing it honestly and um i really loved the finale of the last episode i thought that it wrapped up like really really well and um god yeah i'm just excited to see ismail season and, and to learn all about them and see what their home like life is like it's gonna be like such a new story to this, to this scam franchise i mean Druk was actually the first remake or any version of scam to have the first trans storyline if I'm not if I'm remembering correctly with David and now they're doing a non-binary season it's just they're killing it Druk Druk just it's that bitch Druk is that bitch and um yeah they're doing they're doing some groundbreaking breaking things and, and it's really really cool to see and I'm like obviously such a huge scam fan and and it's just come so far from that that little Norwegian show, you know, and it's beautiful. It's it's awesome, and it, it, I always wonder what could have happened if Scam had continued and done what these shows have done. It would have just been groundbreaking. But Druck is filling those shoes and killing it. I am so excited. I do want to get right into this, guys. Um, another reminder, if you don't know, I'm sure you know, uh, the link at the top of my description will take you to my Patreon and you can get the uncut reactions to Druk, all of the other Scam remakes I've watched, all the episodes as well as season 3 and 4 of the original Scam. And if you want to watch those, you can watch the whole episode with me. You will also get uncut reactions to every show that I react to on my channel, all under one tier. You don't have to pay for individual shows. It's like all under one. So you can get Supernatural, you can get Riverdale, you can get walking dead you can get scam all for one price which is pretty cool so if you're interested check it out otherwise they're still gonna be on youtube but they're just gonna be heavily edited but if now let's get into them I'm so excited oh there they are oh my god they look so cute in those sunglasses also um a shout out to druck translations i'm so glad that there's i mean druck i always felt i got i gotta shout them out real quick I always felt that with Druk, they're so on top of doing the subtitles for the English-speaking people, and it's fucking awesome. Like, they do it clip by clip and the full episode, and it's so fast, so fast, and I, I love it, I love it, and it's, yeah, so shout out Druk Translations for letting your girl watch Druk. It's pretty fucking cool. Ich hoffe, du hattest eine gute Zeit mit deinen fancy Friends. Auch wenn ich nicht dabei war. <lacht> fancy Friends. Das war irgendwie schon seltsam, so dich zwei Wochen nicht zu sehen, nachdem wir während dieser ganzen gottlosen Pandemie so oft zusammen abgehangen haben. Und es tut mir leid, aber ich habe eine Verabredung verschieben. Aber ich habe mich einfach zu spät um eine Fahrkarte gekümmert. Hold up. Are we going to be introduced to a love interest in the first, like, 20 seconds of the season? Also, I'm so sorry that my hair looks crazy my um once i got haircut my hair remembered that it likes to be curly so yeah i'm trying to tame it but you know i, cu I cut my hair when i cut my hair and they um and my hairdresser blow dried it 
all of a sudden my hair was like whoop and I was like shit. Ich habe paar nice Songs in unsere Playlist gepackt. Aww. I wonder if the love interest is going to be the person that stays the love interest. Alles wieder so hektisch gerade kommen müssen los. Jetzt sind schon wieder. Ja. You know it's so fucking hilarious. You know how I used to call him Casper? I when I was looking at the cast, I think it said his name is Casper in real life. Yeah, his name is literally Casper. I had no idea his name was Casper when I called him Casper the Friendly Ghost. Leute, wie wär's hiermit? Aww. What's the guy's name? Sasha? Sasha? Wollt ihr noch letztes Familienfoto machen? Ja. Okay. Aufstellen! Runter hier, runter. Wait, what, do you, what does that mean? Why a last family picture? What's going on? Oh, last oh no, it's vorbei sein. Yeah, it's so gotta be because they're... they're also, they're beautiful. Look at their skin. Drop the skincare routine, honestly. <laughs> sounds of loud being. <laughs> Not just sounds of being, sounds of loud being. Dein Lippenstift, der passt farblich perfekt zu meinem Auto. <laughs> really? I'd be like, okay. <laughs> Aw. I feel like them saying really it was like a way of like when when they say it matches perfectly, I feel like Ismail was so relieved that that was the reason, you know, why the person like scoffed or kind of was like, <laughs> you know. And that it wasn't to make fun of them. So neu? Ja. Ich bin Lou. Lou. Ah, da bist du ja. Leute, das ist unsere neue Mitschülerin Luise. Aber man nennt sie Lou. Ah. Oh. Das ist dein Tisch. Mhm. Mm Beeindruckend. So wie du. It's interesting. Tiger. It's cute that Constantine corrected the teacher and said Lou instead of the name the name the teacher gave because um but i'm sure the constantine went through it with easy as well i might be butchering that i gotta i gotta listen to the name and see what it sounds like aufklärung sturm und drang yeah. sturm und drang also ja yeah. <laughs> oh my god are they gonna like have um, a thing das ist eine literatur ach ja yeah? imagine if they had a thing it's interesting und die müssen jetzt alle rein naja die erfrieren sonst am wochenende soll es schon unter oh ist das geil Und äh, das ist das Familienoberhaupt Lizzo Evertute. Evertute. Evertute, 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 Evertute. Das ist eine richtige Beatboxer-Family, oder? Ja, die haben auch Weltmeisterschaften. Oh. Und Geil. Evertute. Are they dating? Das war ihr Seemed like it. Or that or Ismail's got a crush. A big one. Because there ain't no way that they don't have feelings for him. Yo, damn, damn. Oh, so that is Sasha. Komm doch auch mal mit. Es ist Halloween und wir verkleiden uns richtig schick. Und ich lass mal verkleiden, das ist echt nicht so meins. Und alle Euro besäufen uns. Are we gonna like find out what they are to each other and also how they know each other? Das wird schön, Oma, sie smiled. Du musst ein paar Pflanzen aussortieren. Und mit ein paar meine ich nicht nur zwei, eher die Hälfte. Ja, aber Anne. Aber Anne, Jok, überleg dir was. Nächste Woche muss dieses Zimmer begehbar sein. Halt mal kurz. Yo, pass auf. <lacht> That literally just I'm like, yo, piss off. Das ist doch kein Grund, deinen Lebensbaum zu killen, man. Die Ärmste. Ich muss aussortieren. Okay, also wenn du mir Aurora anvertraust, dann behalte ich sie. Aww. They're cute. I am confused though if they're dating or friends or what. Aww. Hey, and for the rest of the family, we find another place, okay? Is Sasha non binary too? Because the mom said they, but I don't know if they, I don't know if she meant like Sasha particularly or like Sasha's family. Uh, trying to make them feel better, it's so cute. Oh my god, this season is gonna have such good music. <laughs> Oh my god, this ramp reminds me of Axel and Mia. Hey Ismail! Oh Mut, du hast heute echt richtig gut abgeliefert. Ich freue mich voll, dass wir dich jetzt im neuen Team haben. Yes, mein Bruder. Der E-Jugend war auch schon die schnellste. 
Und wenn er erstmal angekommen ist, dann macht er auch seine tricky Tore. Das glaube ich sofort. Ist das eigentlich dein Bruder oder deine Schwester? What did he say? Sorry, I kind of zoned out. Ist das eigentlich uh, dein Bruder oder deine Schwester? Neither, bitch. Oh, I'm sure that's hard enough to hear for them, but like now they also feel bad about their little little brother hearing it. Habt ihr den Post über die Halloween Party gesehen? Ja, sieht voll sick aus. Die Location sieht richtig heftig aus. Habt ihr schon Kostüme? Na, die geht bestimmt als Hexe. Man. Nein, man, halt so als Witch, weißt du, ist doch eigentlich voll nice. Shut ich up. Ich will sofort in ihrem Kopf. You didn't mean that in a good way. Shut up. Haven't y'all learned your f***ing lesson about talking shit about people? Warum lässt du sie nicht ein zu Halloween? Uh -huh. ja. Ich? Ja. I feel like Constantine has a little crush on her. Come on, sei mal Wingman. Diese Wingman-Sache ist irgendwie albern. Ey. Schon nice, sie zu fragen. Constantine suddenly doesn't look pasty anymore. Hättest du nächsten Freitag Zeit für eine Halloween-Party, die so ein paar Leute aus unserer Stufe organisieren? Will dein schüchterner Freund, dass ich komme? Oder du? Both. <lacht> ähm, schätze beide. Mm, sag ihm, ich überleg's mir. Aw, I f***ing ship it. I love that Constantine immediately had a little crush. Was ist das denn für eine Antwort? <lacht> oh my god, they're poison ivy. I f***ing love that. Go! Literally not pretty at all. Where is Fatu? And why hasn't Kimi been with Fatu? Hä? Meinst du, sie ist wirklich gekommen? Ja, komm, das ist der. Komm! Oh mein <lacht> Gott, da sind Ranken. Lu! Lu! Digga, ich hätte wirklich nie geglaubt, dass sie doch kommen würde. Komm, 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 komm! Oh, <lacht> getting all excited. Uh! Uh! Guck mal, was ich gefunden habe. Krass. Sieht heftig aus. Jetzt müssen wir es nur noch dazu kriegen, dass es sich öffnet. They all a bunch of crazies. Ooh. Imagine the whole thing just like lit on fire. This is like <laughs> freaky. Ooh. I already like Come Constantine on, better. Hey. There's the party. Oh my god, there she is. Queen. <laughs> I would expect nothing less than her costume. Be that. Sasha not gonna go. Oh, there's Sasha. Aww, that was cute. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Whoa. That was really sad. It's not should have like turned to him and been like, you know, like come join so that he didn't seem like freaked out about them dancing. Poor Sasha. Now he's freaked out about them dancing. That was so cute though. But at the same time, my head is like, I don't know what the season's gonna be about at all besides Besides Ismail being non-binary, you know? But there we go, that was the season 7 premiere of Druck. This was really good. Not too much has happened yet. Uh, all I know is that Ismail is f***ing adorable. Okay, um, I'm, I am trying to figure out. I've seen, I saw that, I think Kumi and then their mom called them by Ismail. Because I was worried for a second that if, that, is Ismail might be their dead name. I might just go by Izzy now, but I don't know. So let me know. I don't know. Maybe that's just not something that we know yet in the show. It's um, it's a little bit like kind of hard because in the show, as far as we know, I as as far as I am at this point, um, I don't even know that they're non-binary. You know, I just know because people told me. You can tell that they're like non-binary you know that they don't identify as either but i'm not sure about the name yet so i guess we'll find out um i don't know if maybe just Izzy's is he's like a, a nickname or like a name that they feel like fits them better but maybe it's still like their full name i don't know sasha is adorable okay 
Izzy and Izzy and, Sh- and Sasha are just fucking cute. And the that dance that they do with the mouth or whatever is so cute. And it made me really sad when Lou pulled Ismail away and and then Sasha's just looking at them like defeated. Like they should have fl- like waved down Sasha and been like, you know, come here. So that way he felt like they weren't just trying to leave, you know? The Kumi and Fatu kiss was so cute and the costumes were hilarious but that kiss ooh, that kiss was good we do know that Ismail has a younger brother and he kind of a little bit gets teased about Ismail and um of course that probably hurts Izzy to hear but then they also like feel sad about for their for their brother you know the brother of course like doesn't want them like touching them it's just kind of (laughs) like leave me alone you know Constantine surprisingly was fantastic in this episode. I really liked him this episode. His little crush on Lou is really, really cute. And um, I love how immediately when Lou said their name was, or her name was Lou to Constantine, and then the teacher called her by her full name, Constantine immediately corrected him. And it was probably because like, you know, he knows the story with Ismail. So who knows what it could be with Lou. And then immediately Constantine just like has this little crush. It's really cute. And Constantine is so likable this episode. We finally get to see him like be happy and cute, you know, instead of just being kind of like a sulker. Um, so it's going to be really interesting learning more about Constantine. I still want to understand. I don't fully understand, but I want to um, understand the Ismail and Tasha relationship. Are they dating? Are they friends, like, with a little bit of a crush? I don't know. I have no clue. I feel like they're not dating because they they don't, like, kiss goodbye or they're not, like, constantly, like, really close to each other. They look like really close friends, but it definitely seems like Sasha at least has a crush on Ismail. I bet you they have a crush on Sasha as well, but I can definitely feel it from Sasha. So that's going to be really cute and we can see how that unfolds. I'm guessing that that's going to be their love interest. For the show they sort of like kind of made it seem like Lou might have a thing for Ismail but I don't know because it seems like Lou is like much more interested in what Ismail's doing than what Constantine's doing and maybe that's why Sasha felt weird about it I don't know so that's going to be interesting because I don't know what Ismail prefers in terms of like a partner I don't know if they're open to everybody or if they like men or if they like women I'm sure probably men maybe they're pan and they're completely open to anybody and it's just kind of interesting if that's going to be like a you know like a love triangle type thing but yeah i'm interested um to see more i'm so sad that this episode is like 20 minutes and i downloaded the episodes and they all look around like 20 minutes which is really short i hope they fill in a good story in that time i'm sure they do Druck is good about like keeping the episodes short but they still have all the information you need without it, like, feeling rushed, you know? They're really good at that. But yeah, really enjoyed the episode. Super, super looking forward to Ismail's season. I think that was pretty much it. I will see you guys in episode two. Thanks for watching.